fjölskylda, family. Samtal 1. Áttu systkini? Já, ég á einn bróður og tvær systur. Bróði minn heitir Ketill en systur mínar heitar Rakel og Siv. En þú? Nei, ég er enga barn. En hvað heitar fóreldra þínir? Mamma minn heitir Björg og pappi minn Arnþór. Áttu frændur eða frændkur? Já, ég á frændku sem heitir Elisabeth. The words for describing your immediate family relatives all have irregular declensions. Móðir and sisters are both strong feminine nouns but have different nominative and accusative forms. Móðir has a vowel change in the plural too. So, móðir, móður, mæður, mæður. Sistir, sistur, sistur, sistur. Bróðir is masculine but actually follows the same pattern as móðir. So, bróðir, bróður, bræður, bræður. Father follows a completely unique pattern with vowel changes in the singular accusative and plural forms. So, father, further, feather, feather. Mama and puppy both decline as regular weak nouns, so you can use those instead of the more formal mother and father. However, brother and sister do not have simpler equivalents. Sonur and dóttir are also irregular. Sonur has the expected endings for a strong masculine noun, but there's an extra vowel change in the plural. Sonur, son, sinir, sini. Note that in patronymic names it's always son in the nominative, so jónson and not jónsonur. Dóttir follows the same pattern as móðir, but there is the extra quirk of the double T becoming a single T in the plural. Dóttir, dóttur, dætur, dætur. The word frændi is also slightly irregular in the plural. The ending is ur in both the nominative and the accusative. This is reminiscent of the pattern for words uh, ending in andi, like nemandi, plural nemendur. Frændi, frænda. Frændur, frændur. Viðskeiti, prefixes. These prefixes can be used to modify family words. Lang is equivalent to great, so lang ama is great grandmother. Lang ama, lang avi. Stjúp is equivalent to step in English, so stjúp bróðir means step brother. Stjúp bróðir, stjúp fáðir, stjúp sonur. Hálf means half, hálf systir, hálf bróðir. Tengda means in-law. It can be used with any family word except bróðir and systir, which for some reason have their own unique words. So mágur, brother-in-law, and mágkona, sister-in-law. But the others are tengta fáðir, tengta pappi, tengta dóttir, and so on. Finally, we have the words frændi and frænka. They just mean male and female relative, respectively. Icelandic doesn't distinguish between cousins, aunts and uncles, and nieces and nephews by default. Uh, you just use frændi or frænka, and it's normally understood from the context who you're talking about. In case of ambiguity, you have words like móðurbróðir and systerdóttir that describe specific aunt and uncle and niece and nephew relationships. So can you work out what each of these words means? Mother brother, further brother, brother sonur, sister sonur, 
móðursystir, föðursystir, bróðurdóttir, systurdóttir.